So you have a LG Stylo 6 and you have an issue where the screen is black. However, you know the phone is on. Maybe you can receive phone calls. Maybe you feel it vibrate. Maybe you see some LED notification, lights like pop on. Anyways, the only thing is the screen is like not coming on, okay? I'm going to give you guys several solutions, uh, several solutions to get you up and running right now. But take note that this one is fixed. But we're going to go ahead and go through every step here. And most of you guys are going to be up and running by the end of this video, okay? All very easy steps. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to force the phone to restart. How do you do that? It's a two key combination. What we want to do is hold down the volume down button and the power button. Press and hold both buttons at the same time. Do not let go until we see the LG logo appear and then let go, okay? So it, it, you're basically just forcing it to restart. You're not going to lose any, any information. So volume down, power button. Ready? One, two, three. Press and hold. Pretend my screen is totally black here. I'm still holding on both buttons. I'm not going to let go until I see a LG logo appear. Still holding on both buttons, waiting for that LG logo. There it is. Go ahead and let go, and hopefully you are back up and running. Now, if that force restart didn't work for you, next thing I want you to do is this. Go ahead and plug in your charger, and I want you to actually charge it, okay? Pop it in here. Pretend again my screen is totally black here. Now wait about five minutes. Give it a little bit of extra juice. After five minutes, while it's plugged in and still charging, do the same thing. Force restart it. Volume down power button. Ready? One, two, three. Press and hold both buttons. Again, pretend my screen is totally black. I have no idea what's going on on my screen. I'm just holding on both buttons, hoping I get an LG logo to appear. Still holding on to it. I'm still charging my phone as well. There's LG logo. Go ahead and let go. And hopefully you guys are up and running now. If not, we're going to go to the next step. All right. So for this next method, what we're going to do is what I call the tap method. Okay. Let's just pretend the screen is black here. Now, what I want you to do is use two fingers. Now I want you to tap all over the screen and all over the, all over the back as well. A lot of times it's a small disconnect. Something's like dislodged like a little bit. Sometimes just a couple taps will get it back working. Okay. Anyways, use two fingers. And what you want to do is press kind of hard or tap kind of hard all over on the screen. Flip it over, same thing. Two fingers, just tap. Make sure you get all around the fingerprint scanner right here as well as the lens, the camera lens. Keep tapping all over, just like that. Now, really quickly, I want you to get a power button and I want you to press the power button in and out like crazy. Just go ahead like this. Sometimes your power button is stuck, jammed or loose as well. Just keep pressing it just like that. Now I want you to do the same thing, okay? Force it to restart. Remember, volume down, power button. Ready? One, two, three. Press and hold now. Pretend my screen is black. Continue to hold both buttons until we see an LG logo appear. I'm still holding here. Hoping that LG logo appears. There it is. Go ahead and let go. And hopefully you guys are up and running. Now, if you're still down, the next thing I want you to do is this. And I call this the massage method. Now, what I want you to do is use two, two of your thumbs and I want you to press on the screen really hard all over on the screen as well on the back, okay? You can go ahead and use some kind of cloth or towel or even like a paper towel or whatnot if you don't want to get um, your screen all smudged. Anyways, just go ahead and use two thumbs and press like this. I'm pressing all over, all up here. Just keep pressing. Now go ahead and turn it over. And do the same thing on the back, okay? You want to press all over. Press. Give it like a nice massage here. All here. Even on the lens too, okay? All around the lens right there. Just keep pressing it all over. Then after that, do the same thing. Force restart it. Remember, volume down, power button. Press and hold both buttons until you see the LG logo appear. Then let go, okay? And then once it boots back up, Hopefully you guys are up and running. Now, if you're still down, next thing I want you to do is this, and I call this a smack method. What we want to do is put out your palm of your hand like this, and I want you to smack the back and the front of the screen as well, okay? So we'll start off with the back here and just... Same thing on the bottom of the back. On the screen now. On the bottom of the screen. Now, go ahead and perform the force restart again, and hopefully you are up and running. Now, if you're still down, 
The next thing I have for you to do, and this might sound uh, ridiculous, but I've gotten a lot of phones up this way, is simply grab your phone, go to your freezer, okay? Not the refrigerator, you wanna put it in the colder part, in the colder part, the uh, freezer. What you wanna do is leave it in there between 10 to 20 minutes. After 10 to 20 minutes, pull it out of your freezer just like this, your phone's gonna be nice and cold. Do the same thing now. Force restart it. Press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until you see that Apple logo appear. And hopefully you are back up and running. Now the thing is, most of you guys should have your phone back up and running now. You should the, the, the black screen should be gone. However, if you're still having issues, then what I would suggest is go ahead and start from the beginning of the video and try every single step. Try it three, four, five, six more times. Keep trying, and then chances are your phone's gonna be back up and running, okay? Anyways, if this worked for you, give me a thumbs up. Let me know which step worked for you. Sometimes it's a combination of two, three steps that actually get it up as well. If it didn't, give me a thumbs down. Like I said, by the end of this video, most of you guys will be up and running. Good luck.